Hey friends, welcome to Tori Talks TV. I'm Tori, and this is my husband, Brian. We're going to be talking about Big Brother 22 All-Stars, Episode 10, Eviction Night. Uh, I dressed up for this. Thank so you I. for dressing up as well. All right, so... It's my going out shirt. My faves are on the block. One of them's about to go home. I'm a little heartbroken, but, you know, Janelle did some really great campaigning. Didn't she? Did no. she? Well, she tried. I mean, there's just, like, not much you can do at this point, but... And I also feel like there's not, I, there's just been so many seasons, like there's nothing new that you can say. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't know. She tried, and then they had some really stealthy editing to make us think like, wait, could she flip the vote? And then sometimes I was like, oh wait, no, there's no way she's going to flip the note. So then I was like, I don't know, we'll leave it at that. So let's talk about the drama of the night, which is is David Gate. I, <laughs> David, did you name it David Gate? I, well... No, I can't take credit for that. The feedster said that. But I don't really understand how it got so dramatic. I feel like we didn't get to see all of what really went down. So apparently Tyler and Cody said that Danny said Davon was going to flip the vote and try to get David out. Okay, that that's where it started. But then David went and told Devon. I, I don't really understand. So... Devon was like, no, dude, I was trying to save you. And then Tyler somehow gets in the mix and he's like, you ruined my game. You're coming after me. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't get it's it. It's my head on that block next like, week. Like maybe Devon and Bailey, but otherwise, who are we worried about coming after you, Tyler? That was really weird. Bruh. Are there holes in that story? Because I don't think it was that big of a deal. I don't, man. I'm just like, okay, this is what I think. They've been cooped up in this house. They got no TV, no source of entertainment, and then they're all stars, so they're used to constant attention and all that stuff. So I'm thinking that these dudes are these people are not dudes, but they're blowing things out of proportion. Yeah, and I know that I do understand that Tyler is upset with David because he feels like, well, I can't tell you anything. And can somebody explain to me uh, David's gameplay? He doesn't. He's I don't, a, he doesn't know how to play the game. How do you spell rookie? D A V I D. That's what it is. That's the problem. He's he's like the definition of a rookie. Yeah. He's making so many mistakes. Tyler and Davon yeah. were like his guiding light. The two people that were going to keep him safe. And he resisted Davon. Yeah. Calmed and down. And, and then, then threw him under the bus. And then threw Tyler under the bus. Your, your, your lifelines, Bruh. you just burned them. He was my favorite, too, until I realized how bad he is at the game. I'm like, oh, my God. I'm a terrible judge of character. That's just what it is. We had high hopes for him, but in our defense, we didn't know much about him. We just wanted him to get a fair shot. We're just rooting for the underdog. Just no sh more. Shut your mouth. No more. I, David, I don't know if you're trying to play it cool, but at least he did admit, like... Ooh. He started it, too. He's, he's like, they cornered me. He's like, did they corner you, or did you initiate the conversation with Bailey in the Avnot room? Maybe. Should do win. He felt like he owed it to her, but... He's trying to get close to people. That's all it is. Oh, it's so strange. I don't understand. So if anybody wants to explain to me what David's doing. He doesn't know. He doesn't know what he's doing. So why can't, how can anyone explain it to you? All right. I know. He's in full panic mode. He's just making everybody mad and weary and paranoid of him. So good luck, David. I was really rooting for you. I don't know what to do with you. All right. Yeah. Let's move on to heartbreak hotel. Um, so again, with the editing for when they were voting. Yeah. And we see Danny and Enzo vote Kesar out. I was like, there's a chance that Janelle's going to stay. And then, no, 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 no. If I no. vote a 9-2. to two, My girl, my favorite, Janelle, was voted out of Big Brother. Yeah. Okay, what I don't understand is, so when Danny voted for Kesar, she kind of laughed, like, I can't believe I'm doing this, but I vote to evict Kesar. But, or was it, like, smirky, like, it's time for me to stir the pot a little bit. So Enzo, I don't know what Enzo was doing. I feel like he was just being Enzo because Meow Meow is so funny like that. Enzo. But I think Danny is continuing her planting seeds and making people paranoid. Because if you go back to David Gate, Danny's the one that told Tyler and Cody that Davon flipped the vote, which she probably really didn't. Danny is a little instigator, and she's being very sneaky. Yeah, she's being a little. Yeah, she's. I mean, she's it's playing the game good, but well, it's 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 a little like. I don't know. After reading some of, like, the feed notes that people have put up there, they know that she's playing the middle. They, they're they catching on yeah. to her. And this is all stars. You, you, 
people are going to catch on to you sooner rather than later for All Stars. Yeah. So, I don't know. I'm just really surprised. She wanted to get her on more than anything. But, yeah, definitely you're trying to cause some stuff, some commotion. That's what Danny's doing. Yeah. So, poor Kesar has never done this game without Janelle. I think he's going to fly under the radar. I really do. I don't know. But they did the HOH competition, and we don't get to know who the HOH is. It's my least favorite when they make you wait till Sunday to find out who HOH is. Who do you think it's going to be? Uh, either Danny or Cody or Memphis. Yeah. I was thinking Danny. I think that might just be because I want her to win. It's This has been a really perplexing year for me because I have favorites in the house that are not necessarily working with each other. And I don't understand why Danny has taken Nicole under her wing, except that maybe she's easily manipulated. Yeah, well, she can I think make her crazy. actually. I think what she's doing is maybe she's using her Nicole as a shield. Yeah, you know what I mean. Like uh, out of the two, which one won? You know, which one won? You know, you got to get yourself close to the winner because, like, if they're gonna come at the end of the day, final two, the they're final not two, vote for the winner. they're not gonna vote for the winner. Winner. <laughs> the winner. The winner. They're not going to vote for the winner. <laughs> right. Yes. <laughs> I don't know, but I I do want to applaud Danny. She's doing some things, but she, I think she needs to reel it in just a little. Yeah, she's going a little overboard with the power thing. That, that's a, that, man, I guess the house does that to you. Like, you know, she's like, she either, like, anything that you do, you do a little too much. You're like, oh, this is working. Then maybe if I do it with this person, it'll work even more. It's like, bro, just chill. You did it once. All right. It's oh, enough. She's getting things all riled up. But uh, I guess as long as they keep her name out of it, then it'll be fine. Anyway, we'll see. We will find out Sunday who the head of household is and um, also who they nominate. Oh, man. Let this season get a little more interesting and yeah, season's so yeah, it's, But it always <laughs> happens in the beginning. It's always That's predictable. True. It's that always is so predictable. True. So uh, I, I usually, like, whenever we watch Big Brother, I'm like, I'm not in until, like, probably halfway. Halfway, yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, let us know what you thought about this episode of Big Brother. Comment below and then like and subscribe while you're there, please. And thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.